travelling from Kabul to Modem Shah. The road's got several fixed security checkpoints. It should take us between 30 and 40 minutes, depending on the traffic. The most likely threat, I think, will involve us being caught up in an insurgent attack on one of the coalition convoys that regularly uses the route. That attack would probably involve an, an IED explosion, followed by direct fire from insurgents, most likely from AKs and PK machine guns, RPGs and so on. It's also possible that our police escorts could be targeted. The fact that there are two foreigners in the area the police escort word of that will very quickly spread. The villagers who live in and around the compound, they're not likely to give us trouble because they want to get information about what was behind the raid that killed and injured their relatives and they also want to tell us their story. When you think about it, there really can't be any more important matter of public interest than when a government sends its young men and women to a foreign country to fight, uh, possibly to be killed, and to kill other people. I mean, that is a matter of great public interest. Why are they going? Is it in our national interest? Is the cause just? Is it being fought in a just manner? I think those are questions that New Zealanders definitely need to, to have answers to.